In this video, I want to explain the three worst habits that you could possibly doing as a teenager that will absolutely ruin your life. You might be doing them already without even realizing the damage and the severe consequences these actions can cause your future self. They can impact your 20s, your 30s, your 40s, and even into your senior years. That's right, these habits should not be played around and these habits should be taken extremely seriously. Coming in at number three, we have underage drinking. Obviously, it's not good for you because it's prohibited by the law in most countries. Overdoses of alcohol can cause liver damage, heart disease, cardiovascular issues, and etc. Plus, alcohol is stated to cause over seven different types of cancer. It is a toxic, psychoactive, independent drug that has been classified as Group 1 carcinogen, which is by far classified as the most dangerous substance out there. Number 2 on the list, we have drugs. Yes, I'm including smoking and vaping on this list. Drugs give you a new type of stimulation, a new type of sensation that's very out of this world, very alien-like. And this alien-like, this unnatural response to your body can cause a severe amount of issues. For example, smoking weed has been shown to actually lower your intelligence levels. And vaping has been shown to irritate the respiratory system and to damage your throat and lungs. What's even more damaging about these new type of stimulations are is that it's very addictive. Even if you know it's bad for you and you try to quit, you can't because your body pledges and always craves for it because of this addiction because the feeling is so good your body wants it more and more because of the dopamine that you receive from it this makes it extremely hard to quit drugs even if you know it's terrible for your health you can't quit and number one on this list the most damaging the most extreme bad habit you could possibly do into your body and the one that most teenagers are doing nowadays number three watching explicit content now why is this damaging you might think that it's a natural response you might think that it's natural to watch this stuff see when you do this dirty stuff your dopamine levels are spiked up however when it ends it comes crashing down however this results in over usage of your dopamine levels and guess what you're gonna run out of dopamine so during the rest of your day you're gonna feel absolutely terrible you're gonna feel drowsy unmotivated dead on a lot that's right you're not going to feel like you live anymore this also lowers testosterone levels ruins future relationships it can actually ruin society altogether as a wise man had said 500 years ago you want to destroy a nation without war make adultery and nudity common in the young generation that is right this stuff is destroying society so in conclusion, all three topics spoken today are all forms of instant gratification. Now, if you are facing one or even all three of these issues, do not be afraid. You can quit and there's still time. The first step is to acknowledge that these three things are terrible for your health. The next thing is to acknowledge that you are addicted. If you say that you're not addicted when you are, you're never going to be able to quit. You're never ever going to find a reason to quit. If someone doesn't acknowledge that they're fat and overweight, they won't put in the effort to exercise and change that. And the same thing is said for here. And finally, you must put in the work. It is hard to get rid of these cravings. Once it's into your body, your body naturally and wants it more and more because of the dopamine. However, you must resist. No matter how much times you must relapse, you must resist and resist until the day comes that your body no longer pledges and urges for it. And there you go. The three most damaging habits you could possibly do as a teenager that will ruin your life, not just now, not just before this happened, but into your 20s, 30s, 40s, and even into your senior years when you're walking on a cane with lower back problems. So if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe. I'm trying to hit 1,000 subscribers at the end of the year and watch these videos right here about my own journey and the video that YouTube thinks that you like. If you don't subscribe, I'll be really angry.